people tend to not like parasites very much. And the parasite images I've seen so far tend to be gross things coming out of people's bodies. I mean, the kinds of things that gets biologists and medical students excited, but is not what the general public tends to appreciate. I want to show how this creature, this parasite, acts in nature. And the best way to do that beyond a photograph is with a time lapse, showing how it grows, how it interacts with its host. The graphic novel approach kind of came out of a desire to portray these creatures in an interesting and dramatic way, to separate one organism from the other. And what was appealing about that is a way to show these parasites in a, a familiar scene that had something very surprising going on. So this is a special mixture of salts that actually mimics the inside of a cricket with its body. And what that means is that the worms will come out, but they'll actually still think that they're inside the cricket's body. Photographing the cricket and the horsehair worm was actually the most difficult setup I had for this whole story. You know, this is, this is biology, like, you don't really get to tell the cricket and the worm when, when to perform. So I, I used this trick that I learned from the, the researcher, and that way I could control the position of the worm and use my lighting technique to tell the story of the parasite and the host. The worms have matured, you can see them coiled up in their bellies. And so those worms are going to bust out as soon as they sense water. I imagined, okay, you put a lot of work, you put a lot of time, and then you become a good photographer, and then it's easy. And it took a while for it to occur to me that that process does never end. You get a great picture, and then you move on. You got a new set of challenges, and then you got a new problem. And that's a great thing. I think I've, had to, I've, I've learned to sort of embrace that process of accepting every new picture as a new challenge and that's become part of the joy of being a photographer.